Tom, a, uh, a game against Peterborough this weekend, you must be quite confident following the result last weekend. Uh, we're, we're sitting mid-table and Peterborough above us. I think uh, it's going to be a tough game, certainly. They drew four all with MK Dons and we nicked a goal to win late on at MK Dons. So it'll be a tough tough test for us. They've got an early, early wake-up call for them and a uh, long journey ahead, but uh, sometimes team face that adversity well and, and come out at you. So it'll be a tough test tomorrow, certainly. We've, uh, we've had a bit of an up-and-down season, but uh, a good result last weekend, the form went over Stevenage. Are we, uh, are we building momentum at the right time? Yeah, it'd be good, good to finish before Christmas with some, some positive results, definitely, um, and some, some positive individual performances as well, certainly following Tuesday night, there, there have been. Um, and yeah, it'd be, it'd be good to follow up with some good results. However, I think it's going to be two tough games, home to Peterborough, who are fifth in the league, and, and then we're away to Colchester, who are top. So uh, the boys are going to have to dig in and work it really hard. I was speaking to uh, a couple of boys earlier today and one thing they have said is that we seem a lot tighter in defence than we were at the start of the season and also a lot more clinical going forward so uh, there's definitely progression there. Yeah, it's certainly progression and, and we've got a young team as I said a few weeks back, we've got a really young team so they're, they're learning, they're developing, that's the main thing is that they're, they're showing every week that they are performing better and, and increasing in performance individually like I say is key. So yeah, it's been good, it's been good. What's the uh, response been like in training from the lads that featured on Tuesday? Because that must be giving them a very big boost. Yeah, they've been positive. Yesterday was really was, was buzzing. Um, today's been a little bit slower, but more tactically based. But uh, yeah, it's been it's been good. The lads really enjoy playing against the likes of a, of a full adult team, you know, semi-professional team, and also playing with the likes of some some experienced professionals. And the lads have uh, they have responded well. I have responded well, maybe a little overexcited a few of them, but uh, it's good for them to have a taste. Does it also give the lads that didn't feature something to work towards? We've also got a very tough game in the next round against Bishop Stortford. Absolutely, absolutely. That will be a very tough test, especially um, away there. But uh, yeah, the lads that didn't feature were all gutted, which is good to see. Um, and yeah, certainly it gives them a bit of a character to work towards, doesn't it? Was there anyone out there that impressed you the most? I know Yasin had a very good game. On the Tuesday, yeah, yes, and performed well. Uh, Alfie and Ford did okay. I thought, to be fair, all of them did all right within their own within their own limits. They've still got to learn about the game a little bit more, developing technically, but still got to learn tactically a bit more, be a bit more aware, do things a little bit quicker. Um, but now there was some good individual performances from them. I know perhaps some people might not take it as a, a, a serious competition, like you with the FA Cup or the FA Trophy, but may, maybe is that different for you guys I mean playing with the likes of John Nurse and Roberto must be sort of one of the biggest progression things that they're going to face this season yeah that's that's the the players have got to take out of that they've got to take the experiences certainly but uh, I think for me I would play every game to try and win it um, as we go forward from from youth team up I think you play every game to try and win it and, and especially I see that the Hearts Senior Cup as a winnable competition for this football club whether it be with the reserves um, and, and the drip feed of the youth, certainly. 